I'm making a really quick starter uh, for today, which is called Bang Bang Cauliflower. You might have had it at Wagamama's. Um, it's quite simple to make, and especially if you make up the sauce beforehand. So I make quite a big jar of this. So I've already got some, so I'm gonna put in my notes what goes in here. Um, but it's essentially sriracha, honey, soy sauce, mirin, and what else do we put in there? Some oyster sauce as well, and soy sauce. Maybe I said that. But anyway, all those uh, five things, I'll put it at the bottom of my notes. So you just put in um, all that quantity, make that sauce. I do try and make a big one, so when I want to make it, it's just ready. So that's your bang bang sauce. And then you have your cauliflower. This is left over from the tacos I made the other day. So half a cauliflower here. I'm gonna put some oil in, into a medium pan, and then get the cauliflower. What's that? And then get the cauliflower in. I've also got some red onion, which will go in a bit later. But this just needs to be on quite a high heat, medium high heat, I'd say about an eight on an induction. And that's because you want it to char quite a bit. You might have seen them, um, if you've had it at Wagamama's, it's quite like charred in certain places and that gives it a really nice flavour. So let that char and once that's charred, that's when we put in the onions and you want to see onions caramelised, we'll put in the sauce and that's pretty much it. And then we serve it up with a garnish of coriander and ginger. So I haven't moved it around too much, left it for a bit and you can see you're getting this nice charring in certain places but that colour is really going to give it that really nice nutty flavour and it does need a little bit more oil just to add a touch if you need it and at this stage once you've got a little bit of colour on there is when you want to add some red onion so that was about sort of a quarter half of a cauliflower and about a quarter of a red onion so this is really dependent on your taste and how much you have um, if you do a, cauliflower, a whole cauliflower then you're going to need to adjust that so a whole cauliflower to one whole medium Red onion. We've been stir frying it for about sort of two, three minutes now. And to make sure that the cauliflower is cooked, you just get a knife or a fork, just pierce it, and it should just go easily through, but not be mushy. You don't want this to be mushy at all. You want it to have a nice bite to it. And it's all brown, it looks a bit like that, and the onions have all gone caramelized. And at this stage is when you put in your sauce. So for about quarter of that cauliflower I'm going to put in three tablespoons you can just sort of judge it for what how saucy you want it how much um flavor you want in there there's not really a rule that says you have to put just many tablespoons in but I'll just give you the recipe for the sauce and then you can decide how much you want to put in there so let that cook for a bit I think it needs a little bit more Let that cook and sort of combine for about a minute or two. Put the heat down a little bit. And there you go, that's quite nicely coated now. And I'll put that into my bowl. And some onions and the sauce. And we garnish that with some fresh coriander. And some really thinly sliced ginger. This is so good for you. It really lifts it. There you go. Bang bang cauliflower. Welcome, Mama Star.